So I recently finished the book, 48 Laws of Power. And the book is by Robert Greene. And there are 48 different laws that he has listed in this book that are like pieces of advice, basically. Things to live by or pieces of advice. So I'm going to go over, at the beginning of the book, there are something called the preface, and it's a short synopsis of each law. I'm going to read the first five right now to you. So law number one is never outshine the master. So let me read what it says to you. Always make those above you feel comfortably superior, and your desire to please or impress them do not go too far in displaying your talents, or you might accomplish the opposite. Inspire fear and insecurity. Make your masters appear more brilliant than they are, and you will attain the heights of power. Law number two. Never put too much trust in friends. Learn how to use enemies. Be wary of friends. They will betray, betray, betray you more quickly. For they are easily aroused to envy. They also become spoiled and tyrannical. But hire a former en enemy and he will be more loyal than a friend because he has more to prove. In fact, you have more to, hear, to fear from friends than from enemies. If you have no enemies, find a way to make them. Law number three. Conceal your intentions. Keep people off balance in the dark and in the dark by never revealing the purpose behind your actions. If they have no clue what you're up to, they cannot prepare a defense. Guide them for enough guide them far enough down the wrong path. Envelop them in enough smoke, and by the time they realize your intentions, it will be too late. Law number four always say less than necessary. When you are trying to impress people with words, the more you say, the more common you appear, and the less in control. Even if you are saying something banal, it will seem it will seem original if you make it vague, open-minded, and sphinx-like. Sphinx-like. Powerful people impress and intimidate by saying less. The more you say, the more likely you are to say something foolish. Law number five, so much depends on reputation. Guard it with your life. Reputation is the cornerstone of power. Through reputation alone, you can intimidate and win. Once it slips, however, you are, you are vulnerable and will be attacked on all sides. Make your reputation unassailable. Always be alert to potential attacks and thwart them before they happen. Meanwhile, learn to destroy your enemies by opening holes in their own reputations. Then stand aside and let public opinion hang them. So once again, a quick review. Law number one, never outshine the master. Law number two, never put too much trust in friends. Learn how to use it. Use your enemies. Law number three, conceal your intentions. Law, law number four, always say less than necessary. Law number five, so much depends on reputation. Guard it with your life. So these were the first five laws of the book, 48 Laws of Power. Like I read through the whole book, but those are just short summaries that the author gave at the beginning of called the preface. So hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, leave me some comments. Let me know what you think. Thanks.